Hello, Junior 4. Let's continue our concept one, adaptation and survival. Previously, you have studied many plant and animal adaptations to different environments. So, what happens if this environment change? If change occurs slowly, which means the change is caused by the nature itself, organisms have time to adapt over many generations. But human activity often rapidly changes ecosystem over days or years, and these rapid changes can cause many organisms to move, disappear, die, or even become extinct. Extinct means that a living organism is no longer exist on Earth. So, let's study some of ecosystem changes that are caused by the nature itself, such as change in temperature, amount of rainfall from seasons, severe weather events like winds, wildfire and flood. Junior 4, you have to only you have only to understand this part. Don't memorize. Understand the difference between the change that are caused by nature which is slowly and change happens by human which is rapidly changed some of ecosystem changes are caused by the human activity like cutting down forests plowing grassland introducing plants animals and disease that were never part of the ecosystem the exhausted from cars and some factories cause air pollution, bad habits such as throwing waste material in waterways cause water pollution, watering the soil with polluted water causes soil pollution. The impact that human activities have on plants, animals and the humans themselves. Plants and animals are affected by changes in an ecosystem caused by humans when air, water, and soil get polluted, where some animals can survive by moving to another ecosystem to find what they need. Plants depend on their seeds to land in a better place for them to survive and grow. Humans are also affected by changes in an ecosystem where air pollution makes the human hard to breathe, water pollution makes the human hard to find clean drinking water, air, water and soil pollution make the crops cannot grow. As humans can cause harmful changes, they can help restore their ecosystems by replanting the cleared forests, removing the pollutant from of air and water, preserving plants and animals in this ecosystem. Plants and animals that live in an ecosystem may have to change their behaviors in order to survive. This is due to the human activities that change the ecosystem. So, plants and animals may undergo structure and behavior adaptation in response to change in the ecosystem. 